Hi folks, my name is Colin Fraser. I'm one of the designers of your template. I'd like to take you on a video tour, starting with downloading your Dreamweaver template. So the first thing we're going to do is log into your account. We'll take you there right now. All right, once you've logged into your account at my i3D themes, now what I suggest you do is throughout the entire video series, we're going to be working off of a folder on our desktop. I'd suggest you do the same thing. Uh, it'll keep things organized and the things you see in the video or the screenshots will make a lot more sense if your template is being built off the same location as what we're doing in the videos. To download a product using your in a browser, I'm using Firefox in this example, you can set your download location so when you download the template it will go directly to your desktop in a zip file format. Uh, for Firefox for example, if we go to the tools and options and the general tab, we can set our downloads right to the desktop. We can just click the browse button, we can click on desktop, select folder, and that sets our downloads to the desktop from this point on. So we're just going to click OK. Now once we've logged into our account, we just find the product that we've purchased located under the account summary, in this case the Fortis 10 Burgundy. We can click the uh, download button, which will take us to our purchases page right here. From this point we click the website template tab, download is already selected. Please go through the end user license agreement and the refund policy. Once you've read those, click your agree to terms. That'll move us to the next stage which is the download package. From here we choose the web editor. We'll select Dreamweaver CS5, CS6. You can also select your format, HTML5 or XHTML which is simply HTML4. I suggest you stick with HTML5 as long as you have a current web editor and then just click the download button. This will create a package for you. It may take a few seconds, it may take a few minutes. The more components or add-ons you have included in your package, the longer it will take to build the template package for you. But you'll see the little uh, progress indicator here showing you how things are going and once that's done a package will be created in a zip file format and downloaded to your desktop if that's where you set the download location in your web browser. And there we go. We're green and we now have a new package on our desktop. I'm just going to minimize my browser, drag that into view, and there it is. When you're done you'll have some sort of a zip file on your desktop using the name of the product you purchased and a license key code. Or actually, sorry, it was a, a packaging code. Uh, usually it goes by the date that it was packaged and the year so that you, uh, if you download multiple copies, you know which is the most recent, etc.